Hey everyone, let's take a look at some of our newest features. Uh, we'll get started by um, starting a new Loewy survey. Continue, choose an end date as we typically would. We published that survey, now we get into sharing the survey, which is where we have some of our new feature functionality. Um, we now, when you go to um, upload your data, uh, we can do custom cohort mapping, which is really exciting. And so in this CSV upload, you can see that I have some column headers that I can um, map to the default list that we allow. Um, so instead of year at company, we call that tenure. Um, and I'm mapping all of these. And then there's one that I, a column I have in my data set that doesn't map to a cohort. So it's still going to be able to process even if I have unique columns in the data set. So you'll see six columns will be imported, one will not. We can see the preview email that's going out. And then we see the number of recipients that are going to see the email or receive the email. So we send that invite out, it was successfully sent, and then the user lands on the sent survey page. Um, so they can see all of the email addresses that received the survey when it was first sent. And then also if it's been you know, a day or two later and we wanna send them a reminder email, we can select the employees that we want to receive that email. We can also, if they've already replied, it, they we won't be able to select their name. So no one is going to get um, multiple emails. So we then draft the email after we select who we want to remind. You can also select everyone if you want. Um, those names are listed here. We can update this email if we want. Um, and then we're going to leave this selected. So send reminder email to existing contacts. Um, and this is going to allow us to send duplicate emails out intentionally. So we send that invitation and that email was sent out again to those individuals. And if it was a new date, um, the, that date would show here. And then on the dashboard, You'll also be able to see the latest stats on the survey there. So we go to our open surveys and we see that 10 emails have been sent. So 10 um, individuals at the company, 10 employees have received that email. Um, and this will update if we choose to go in again and send out um, to a new list of employees. If we wanna change it up and then maybe add manually, we can do that. So the company can um, interchange, you know, if they want to use a CSV file upload versus adding manually. Um, and then this also works for appending data as well. So let's say the first time if I just added email addresses, if I go through this uh, flow again, it'll append any new um, cohort data to the email addresses that we have on file. 